Hey hi everyone uh, welcome to my channel BMP and uh, this video is about to go over common networking components uh, this slide shows basic network topology and common networking component uh, this network topology is consists of switches which are layer 2 devices uh, router which is layer 3 device file server uh, different media here um, van link for the remote office here so this is a van link here and then the internet and remote access so remote access for the small office home office okay uh, starting from the bottom here uh, there are different department users they are connected uh, to the switch using the network interface card called NIC and uh, they are used they may be using the cat5 or cat6 cable uh, category 5 or category 6 cable um, this network card um, or interface card they have the burning address or call MAC address and um, these switches uh, they learn these addresses and manage traffic uh, efficiently so for example user 1 if he wants to send the traffic to user 2 uh, switch will directly send the traffic between user 1 to user 2 okay um, we will talk more about those switches in later videos uh, next all these switch all these switches they are connected to the um, this is a more powerful switch here uh, and these are the uplink ports here so uh, usually this switch uh, they uh, these ports here they if they are like 100 mbps 100 megabits per second port this uplink port it is usually at the higher speed of the 1 gigabit ethernet okay um, this file server is also connected to the switch here as well next uh, we'll talk about router which is layer 3 device so router they forward, forward the data from between network so router is connected to the two or more data lines here in this case is connected to the three here and then the, when data packets come in one of the line the router reads the address information inside the packet to determine the destination and then using this information it using the routing table which is reside in the router and routing policy and it directs the traffic um, on, on the on the different on the on the different interface so for example if someone from the engineering if he wants to talk to the branch office here the packet travels to these switches it goes to the router router will determine that this particular user he wants to communicate to the branch office and then it will get the packet here based on routing table and policy it forward the packet to this uh, media here to the branch office okay. um, when link here here when link is used to connect to the branch office and this when link could be a lease line circuit switch or packet switch okay um, we can cover the van in upcoming videos um, in the last uh, there is a small office home office here and uh, he is connected or that user is connected uh, to the internet using the RF cable or DSL technology uh, usually when when remote worker is working from home uh, they use a VPN uh, and then to the VPN they can uh, connect to the internet uh, and it provide it provide the secure internet connection and then he can log into the corporate office so if this is a corporate office here and this small office home office can connect to this um, VPN here that's the virtual private network okay so this is a very basic uh, information on common networking components uh, hopefully you like this video if you like it please subscribe to my channel okay thanks for watching bye